Now we take it to Green County where this foul smelling biogester you see right behind me shut down in October and recently it asked for more time to clean out the property. Renergy's facility was supposed to get documents to the Ohio Attorney General's office today proving the plant emptied its equipment, but that did not happen. New Center 7's Kayla McDermott is live in Bath Township, not far from Fairborn. Kayla, Renergy will now have until mid-February to do that work. That's right, and it doesn't smell right now at all. And as you mentioned, that's because this plant is not in operation. Anybody who is working over there is working on cleaning out storage tanks. The facility did agree last year to empty those tanks, terminate its permits, and completely shut down by today. But the Ohio EPA sent us a statement this afternoon that Renergy requested an extension to February 15th to get rid of the remaining material, which the Ohio EPA and Attorney General's office agreed to. That request was just put in on January 30th yesterday. Now, the reason for the extension is because of the recent weather we've had. The frigid temperatures this month, plus rain, made it difficult to work, and that's why the material in the concrete storage tank is still there. And now, I talked to a woman who can see this plant from her backyard. She said she's okay with the extension. She just wants to make sure all of this gets cleaned up, and she's hoping that the equipment will be removed, will be removed from here as well, because she's just nervous of someone else coming in here and starting up operation once again. Reporting live, Kayla McDermott, News 7.